Anyway guys, we've received our flow hive now, but first of all, what we'll do is tidy up this mess. We've got a nice spot down the corner here where we can put our bees, heaps of trees around. So what we're gonna do is the kids, we're gonna start cleaning up, we're gonna put some pavers down, uh, and then later on we'll have a video of putting our flow hive together, painting the roof, getting it all together, getting ready for our bees, which should be ready in a few weeks. So we'll talk to you soon and we'll have a video of us cleaning this up. Hey everyone, here is our flow hive roof, which we're going to paint uh, just so it lasts longer, handles the weather better. We're going to put an oil-based undercoat on first, uh, which will really bite onto our timber. And then we're going to coat it with uh, all-weather gloss, and this is our colour we've chosen. It's Torben's Kool-Aid. So hopefully the bees find it nice and cool, and aids them in making honey. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to take this outside, get it undercoated, and get it ready to coat with our colour, and then we'll show you when we're finished. G'day everyone, we're here finish off our flow hive. We're going to do our brew box Kool-Aid again, same as our roof. We'll put one coat of an oil on here to make it last longer. Oil-based undercoat on our brew box. We're going to coat it with our final coat as well now. Two coats of that. So when it's finished, we'll post some more pictures. Everyone, thanks for watching. Yeah, hopefully you got through it all right. Anyway, stay tuned for our next video when we're getting the bees. But before that, make sure you like, subscribe, and tap that bell to make sure you don't miss our next video. Hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time. <laughs>